In this video, we're going to take a look at the powered motorcycle mounting kit for the Garmin Montana and the Garmin Montera series GPS. This is the RAM-B-174-MONT. This is a GPS City exclusive mount. This is a bundle and it's made up of four individual components. Down here on the end, we have our motorcycle mounting base. We have a standard length B socket arm rectangular amps plate with one inch B size ball, and then we have our Garmin powered cradle. Let's start with this mounting base. This is going to attach to your motorcycle, or this can attach to your motorcycle, in one of two different ways. So here we have our one inch B size ball. We have two U-bolts here. These are zinc coated U-bolts and two different sizes, one small, one large. The first way you can use this mounting base is as a U-bolt mount. This would just go around your handlebars. You have the two nuts that are going to go over the U-bolt, and these two rubber caps are going to go over the exposed ends. These two U-bolts between them are going to accommodate diameters between half an inch and one and a quarter inches. That's one way you can use this mounting base. Up here we have a couple more bolts. There's uh, actually two long and two short, and they are threaded differently. But this is to mount off of a brake clutch reservoir that's typically going to be found on the Honda Goldwing series of motorcycles. There's often going to be two vertically aligned bolts on that assembly, and what you can do is remove those bolts and put these bolts on in its place. I have the first one in here. You have a bolt a washer and a spacer. You'd have the other one in the bottom as well, but there are certain motorcycles where this would be a better option for you than the U-bolt mount. So between these two different options, U-bolt and the brake clutch reservoir, this is going to fit a wide variety of motorcycles and allow you to mount your GPS off of it. Down here at the other end, we have our powered cradle. This cradle is manufactured by Garmin specifically for the Garmin Montana and the Garmin Montera series. We have some pins down there at the bottom that are going to provide power to the GPS and some wires coming out of the cradle. This is powered. We have here a red and a black wire, so those can be hardwired directly onto your power source. The red wire does have a fuse built in. We also have here a headphone jack, and then we have green, yellow, and blue. And those are going to give you a serial data connection if you are interested in collecting that information from your GPS. Now, we're not going to get into assembly or installation in this video. We have videos already that show you how to install this mounting base as a U-bolt mount, how to install it as a brake clutch reservoir mount, or even how to use this powered cradle. But what we're going to do now is get our bar set up here. I'm going to put this on as a U-bolt mount, and we're just going to take a look at how this mount is going to appear as a finished product. I finished installing my one inch ball onto my railing here, and I've also attached my one inch B size ball to the back of my cradle so I can finish up the assembly process. All I need to do is take my included standard length B socket arm that can go onto the base, and now I can take the one inch ball on the back of the cradle and that can fit into the open socket. From here, I can make adjustments to it. I can position it however I want. When I'm happy with it, I just need to tighten up the knob on the side of the arm. From here, I can take my GPS, which in this case is a Garmin Montana 650. This GPS has some gold power connections on the bottom. Those are going to line up with the gold pins on the bottom of the powered cradle, so I can get those aligned and then get my GPS secured here into the cradle. Now, ordinarily, if we had this on a power source, putting the GPS into the cradle would boot it up, would turn it on. For right now, this is not on a power source, so it is going to stay off. But with the GPS in the cradle, we can still make adjustments to it just by loosening up the knob. We can move it around, and just as before, you only need to re-tighten it to fix the position. I mentioned before that this cradle would work with either the Garmin Montana or the Garmin Montera. And the Garmin Montera has these same gold connections down here at the bottom. So I can get that into the cradle, get the top secured, and we are all set to go. Now, if I want an added level of security, I can take the security screwdriver that comes with this mount, and I can tighten up this screw head here at the very top. And this makes it so that I am not able to release the GPS from the cradle unless I have this screwdriver. 
Now there is another variation on this mount that we offer. As I mentioned before, the part number for this is the RAM-B-174-MONT. This mount comes with a RAM mount's standard length B socket arm. This arm measures 3 inches from ball center to ball center. We actually offer the same mount with a short arm instead of the standard arm. This mount, or this arm, is one and three quarter inches from ball center to ball center. So this is going to be a great choice if you still want a powered motorcycle mount for your Montana or your Montera, but you just want to keep everything a little bit more compact. Everything is going to be the same except for the arm. You have the same base, you have the same cradle, now you just have the short arm instead of the standard arm. And the part number for this mount is going to be the RAM-B-174-A-MONT. So it's completely up to you. You can go with either mount. It just depends if you want to get a little bit more or a little bit less extension for your GPS. So that is a quick look at the powered motorcycle mounting kit for the Garmin Montana and the Garmin Montera series GPS. This is the RAM-B-174-MONT.